Oh, show. I am feeling kind of stupid looking for something that I could test 3 and 5 amps on this thing. And maybe I have like a motor that pulls exactly 5 amps. No, I have something even better. I have an electronic adjustable load that I can easily set to 3 amps and 5 amps. Yeah, it's giving 0 0.7 volts. Uh, I just glued this one on top of it so it won't fall off. Because usually that is the problem. I usually throw these ones away. We never sell them to customers. I special order the ones with the EU plug. We don't have that problem, so I will use one of these. Right, much better quality. And from what I know, these DC ports, uh, at least the um, panel version, can only handle about 3 or 4 amps. Um, after that they kind of melt, at least with 36 or 48 volt batteries. This one seems to be a little bit more robust. Since it probably has redundancies because of the cable connection, might not always be proper. So this one should probably be able to handle 5 amps or more. I'm a little lazy, so I won't go out and get any wires. I will just... These are special copper ones I ordered, which have really good conductivity. So there shouldn't really be any problem. There we go, there we go. And the red one is well isolated, so we won't have any problems. I will just add a little tape over here, so we don't short circuit anything. And we will turn this one down to zero or we will see sparks. We will reset it and we will connect it to the output. And hopefully we connected everything right or there will be sparks. Let's turn it off. Nothing should happen. Turn it on. The only thing happened is that voltage, exactly 12 voltage showing up on the display. That is very good. And here's the slow dial. Yeah, these potentiometers are restrained, they don't register at all until you go to about 75%. And the small one only gives 0 0.5 amps. So we will forget that one. This one should pull about 2 amps. In, okay, 2.5. And now the voltage is dropping to 10.4. So it can handle um, 2.5 amps, but there will be a voltage drop. So you might as well just use um, batteries rather than this DC converter. I don't really think it's good enough. It should be able to handle 3 amps. Let's just measure with this one where the voltage drop is. It could be on my connections. Um, yes, here we have 10.3. And um, how should we measure that one? We can measure at the cells, which might be over here. The cells are 11.4, so it's not the cells. I'm gonna remove the tape and measure at the crocodiles. And then I'm gonna measure. Yeah, the LEDs is a nice thing. No spark when we connected it, 2.5 amps, and the voltage over here is 10.3. So the voltage, drip, voltage drop might be inside the connector. We will twist this one over and measure at the screws. 10.3. So the voltage drop is a problem inside uh, in the BMS uh, voltage converter and at just 2.5 amps dropping almost two volts make this product kind of useless because if you really don't need that much power and you just need 12 volts you should go with our super power bank or something similar 
this one seems to be about the same quality as the plastic and uh, I do not recommend this let's just go up to 5 amps uh, on 10 volts we should be able to we have 3 amps we're dropping below 10 volts I'm not sure I read the Chinese correctly if it could handle 3 amps 12 to 13 volt 3 to 5 amps it should handle 5 but here we have 4 the cells shouldn't be hot but if the electronics beneath the cells get hot it will transfer to the cells now it's down to 9 volts this was a pretty lame product Here we have exactly 5 amps and 8.4, 8 volts is pretty worthless. Anything need 12 volts to run would be, would not be working at all at 8 volts. And since we measured the drop is uh, inside the electronics, not any connector or my wires. We also mess it with the multimeter. So it, this product is really bad. I do not recommend it at all, unless maybe for less than 1 amp. Oh, shoo! Yeah, uh, these component, components are really hot, like 70, 80 degrees. I don't know what they are, but we are probably at the limit of what this can handle and it handled poorly.